Welcome to Easy Math, where your math lessons are made easier. In this video, we'll be talking about addition and subtraction of integers that involve positive numbers. With all the complicated rules, remembering how to add and subtract integers, especially that involve negative numbers, can be difficult. But here's a little trick to help you. Let's say we want to solve 1 plus 2. First, Imagine a number line with a frog sitting on our first number, 1. The operation plus or minus tells you which direction this frog jump. Since we are adding, our little frog will jump to the right, and the second number tells us how far to jump. That is, since our second number is 2, our little frog will jump 2 spaces to the right, and since he landed at 3, that's our answer. 1 plus 2 equals 3, and we've already learned this in primary school. Let's try another one. What about 3 minus 6? Our first number is 3, so that's where we will start. Our operation is a minus, so our frog will jump to the left. Our second number is 6, therefore our frog will jump 6 spaces. Our frog landed at minus 3, and that's our answer. 3 minus 6 equals minus 3. Let's put your understanding to test. What is the answer for negative 2 plus 4? If your answer is 2, well done. That's right. What about negative 1 minus 2? Yes, that's right. The correct answer is minus 3. Let's take a look at our four examples again. Have you noticed some patterns? Yes, that's right. When two integers are of the same signs, we get their sum and keep their common signs. When two integers have different signs, we get their difference and keep the sign of the number with a larger absolute value. So for 3 minus 6, we keep the sign of 6 since it has the larger absolute value than 3. Hence, our answer is minus 3. And for negative 2 plus 4, we keep the sign of 4 since it has a larger absolute value than 2. Then the answer is 2. This trick always works for me and I hope it works for you. In our next video, we'll be adding and subtracting integers that involve negative numbers. Don't want to miss our next video? Subscribe on our channel by simply hitting the subscribe button and see you in our next video.